work your whole life, struggle, and wake up one day and realize it was all for nothing. It can't be that bad. No, it's that bad. It's that bad. I don't even see the point in trying anymore. I mean, why fight it? What the hell's the point? Mason, you're so upset. Will you come and sit down and relax, please? Yeah. Things without all remedy should be without regard. What's done is done. Macbeth. <laughs> you better go, Veronica. I'm not going to be much company tonight. Look at me. I'm a vicious, cruel, rotten, despicable character. You heard what my father said. So what are you waiting for? Some kind of explanation, I suppose. Mm, yes, of course. Like everyone else, you expect Mason Capwell to always be totally in control. <laughs> Cold as ice, eyes of steel. That's Mason. He'll make a good lawyer one day. The point is, I was sure you didn't know how to feel. Now I know I was wrong. Yeah, pathetic, isn't it? Just the opposite, I would think. No, no, that's kind of you, Veronica, but no, you see before you a broken man. A man who always craved the fight and usually won. All the fights except the one that mattered. Your father is a tyrant. It doesn't take a genius to see that. I wanted to kill him. He drove you to it. Mm, that's no excuse. Mason, you are only human, and nobody can expect more from you. No, are you kidding? They all expect more. My father? Nothing was ever enough for him. I was never the son he wanted, even before Channing was killed. I don't know why I'm putting all this on you. I want to help you. Why? How do you know I'm not some kind of maniac? I know you're misunderstood, and that isn't your fault. No, Veronica, I think I'll have another drink. How about you? I'll get it. On second thought, I'll just have water. You got it. <clears throat> Veronica? Hmm? I'm glad you stayed. So am I. 